everybody, this is Courtney and welcome to another speed build. And today I have a, another Sulani build for you guys. This is a tiny beach home that is very unique in its shape. Um, I was heavily inspired by a photo I found on Pinterest and um, it just, it basically had like a box, like a little box on the bottom. It had um, two like carport looking things on either side of the box and then you know a long rectangle box on top and so that was what I you know used as my inspiration for this build and I really like how it turned out it's actually really cute it's really close to being a starter home I wish I had gotten it to be a starter home but um, when I went to save it I was very happily surprised to see that it was actually a two-pack limited build so um, I wasn't expecting to do another limited pack build this soon since I just did um, a bungalow one that was using seasons and cats and dogs um, but this build only uses island living and seasons so it looks like I can't get away from using seasons but um, honestly I think it might only be using island living and base game obviously if I hadn't used a different door because the door for the bathroom I used a seasons door because um, none of the doors from suit or from uh, from island living were like completely closed like they all had either windows or slits in them or something and so that's the only reason why I use that different door so honestly if you just want to change that door this is only a one pack build so pretty exciting stuff anyway <laughs> So, this is also a tiny home, um, so I guess technically it uses tiny living uh, stuff pack, but when I saved it, it didn't say it used that pack, so I don't know, you know, if you download this and don't have tiny living, if it just doesn't say tiny living, or, you know, tiny residential, whatever, <laughs> but, um, so anyway, yeah, so it is under that, it's a tier 3, um, it's used, like, I can't remember what it says, like 80 something or 90 something tiles, I can't remember. But that was the main reason why um, on that bottom level, the four corners, I only did two sides. Because originally I was going to do like little boxes, you know, so it looked like pillars kind of holding it up. Um, but those take up a tile, so <laughs> I was trying to save tiles there and only did the corners. And I think, I mean, I think it looked, it turned out pretty cool. I don't really like how the foundation looks but I wasn't I couldn't really do much about it but anyway here you'll see my struggle trying to get this ladder to fit in downstairs so it wasn't blocking um, because I, the way I wanted to put it down it kept blocking like the front door so you couldn't get to one side of the house and it was really weird so it uh, I mean it, it turned out eventually but I don't really like how it turned out but can't really do a whole lot about it at least at least we got it to work so that's the important part but anyway so that um, bottom area I you know decided to make that the um, the bedroom area since it's the most secluded it has the windows that are very slightly opened you know so you can't really see in them so I thought that was the best place to put the bedroom so here we are I already you know did the did the kitchen it's a very simple kitchen um, but here we're working on the living room and it's also very simple but I wanted to make sure that there was a TV there um, there is me place in that season store <laughs> um, and just you know bathroom it doesn't have a shower it just has a tub but I thought that was more I was trying you know I was trying to stick to more island living items um, I wasn't at this point really thinking about making it, you know, limited pack, one pack or two pack or anything. I just wanted to do that. But I had, <laughs> I cut out a lot of this. Um, I had so much problems trying to place that light above the staircase where I wanted it to be. Um, so yeah, I mean, I literally cut out like five minutes of me messing with that light. So you're welcome for that because that would have been really boring for you guys to watch. Um, but I also realized that I didn't finish placing tile in the bathroom on the floor um, before I took the photos. So I mean, there's no pictures of the bathroom in the screenshots, but um, yeah, I 
I did fix that, so don't worry, guys, if you do want to download this. Um, speaking of downloading this, if you are interested in downloading this, it is available on the gallery. You can search my username, CrazyCordy, or the hashtag CrazyCordy. There's also a direct link in the description of this video if it's more easy for you to download it that way. And, um... Yeah, I did put the bed under the stairs here, and I did play test everything, so everything does work um, just fine, so no worries there. <laughs> and um, I did give this a couple lot traits, and one of them was the Bracing Breezes one, which has to do with the um, painting skill, apparently. Um, so I made sure to add an easel there just in case, you know, your sims are creative and want to, <laughs> want to do some paintings there. Um, yeah, so originally I was going to make that, um, I think I did, did I leave it? I can't remember, <laughs> I missed it in the video, but I think that, like, the window facing out to the ocean from the bedroom, I wanted it to be open and, you know, pretty, so like, you know, if you're sleeping in there, that's your bedroom, you can just look out and you don't have to go upstairs to, you know, enjoy the ocean, <laughs> so, and I also imagine, you know, if it was real life, you could just jump out the window into the water. <laughs> because that sounds fun <laughs> but anyway we are coming up to the end of this video um screenshots will be coming up in just a minute or so um so yeah i hope you guys did enjoy this i really had a fun time building this and you know just you know building off of an inspiration photo is always fun um i tend to do a lot of floor plans and things from photos only so doing this was a lot of fun so I hope you guys did enjoy it um, if you did enjoy this video please remember to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and as always let me know what you think <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next video thank you guys so much for watching bye